You know, last year I made a video talking about how some years are bad for wild edibles. And especially for individual plants, sometimes the weather conditions are just poor and they can't produce much, if anything at all. That said, it seems this year the opposite is true. Weather conditions this year were fantastic, at least for the strawberries. I rarely ever get anything except maybe four or five from this patch per day, and I have a handful right now. This is probably because it's been very cool and rainy right now, right at the time when these are ripening. This specific patch tends to produce a lot, but if the sun's really strong when they're ripening, oftentimes they're too close to the gravel and they'll literally bake and rot. But since the weather's been cool and humid, they've preserved quite well. Anyone who's ever bought strawberries will know even cultivated varieties in a refrigerator are quite perishable. You can imagine how perishable they are next to gravel in the hot sun. But it does seem that this year luck was on our side and it looks like at least this patch is going to have a very productive year. And it seems growing conditions were really good too. For a wild strawberry, this is actually huge. But size is just one part of it. Let's see how these taste. Mm. I mean, I just love strawberries. Just as good as any cultivated variety. Don't even need sugar. That said, a touch of sugar really brings out the flavor in these, and it makes them probably the best strawberries you'll ever have. I will say, some of these are more ripe than others, and the riper they are, the sweeter they taste, and the more care you have to give them, because these are so perishable, if I were to hold my hand closed, I would probably crush them. Oftentimes I'll just eat the fruits right as I pick them because sometimes these are so ripe and so fragile they will literally juice themselves under their own weight. That is not an exaggeration. Anyway, I do hope you learned something and enjoyed, and as always, I wish you the best. I'm gonna go enjoy these. Till next time.